Good day. In this short video, we're going to both explain and demonstrate how to use link sharing on Samsung devices. So link sharing, we thought originally was part of RCS, which is Rich Communication Services, which replaced MMS, but basically a lot of acronyms here, boiling down to there's a new texting protocol that Google has brought out and most companies have adopted. But it turns out that in fact, what happened is RCS caught on at the same time as link sharing was really promoted by Samsung and so it's easy to get those two things confused. So where link sharing gets used is in your messaging, in your texting. When you want to send somebody a video or a photo or for that matter really any attachment. Previously it would be really crappy and small, uh, it would be really substantially reduced and the reason for that was it was going through the phone companies, you know, your, telcom, your telco companies, cellular service, and they don't want the traffic. The system just wasn't built for that type of data transfer. Well, RCS sends it through your data network instead of the cellular network, right? The old voice network, the old texting network. And if you think that's splitting hairs, let's just make it more clear. For most people, what it will actually go through, and the big improvement here, is that those messages, well specifically the attachments as well, will now go through Wi-Fi, assuming you're connected to Wi-Fi. And that means that the file sizes can be much larger and so things are much higher quality. So let's just take a quick look at how to turn this on and off and why you might want to. So I'm gonna go into my texting here and I'm gonna click on a buddy of mine and I'm going to start writing him a message and I'm just, you know, a bunch of garbage here. And now I'm going to try to attach something. There we go. Now you'll notice in the bottom right hand corner of the screen here that this is set to off. The little cloud is off and that means that I am not link sharing. I'm basically using well whatever texting system I have. Now this is a Samsung S9 but it's the same on virtually all of the Samsungs now. So if you want to turn link sharing on you just press that little button at the bottom right. See? Toggle it on, toggle it off, there we go. Now, this is a video in the top left, so I'll click on that. And with it turned off, you'll see it sits here for a moment. And it spins, and it spins, and it spins. Okay, I'm not going to wait for this any longer. It's just taking too long. So let, I'm just going to click back here and kill it. And then go back into texting. And let's get rid of this draft message. And I'm going to go send the same message, the same video, but I'm going to turn link sharing on. And what this is going to do is because I have a Samsung device, it's going to upload to the Samsung cloud completely free for me. So I'll click on it, send using link sharing, and that's just what it's doing. What it's actually going to do is it's going to take that file, it's going to upload it to the Samsung cloud, and it's going to give me a link. And if I click send, uh, it will send the link to someone else. I'd like to interject for just 10 seconds and ask you to click like if you found this video useful. Our site is dedicated to explaining technology in simple ways and providing cookbook answers for technical problems. We spend a lot of time on Windows 10 and Windows Server. We spend a lot of time on Azure, Office 365, but mostly our products are about how-tos. Lots and lots of cookbooks like how to uninstall something when it's stuck. If you would click subscribe, we would greatly appreciate it. It really helps us with the Google algorithm. Thanks for your help and back to the show. It will not send the actual video. And the advantage to that is, well, one, um, the person receiving it will be able to download it through their Wi-Fi so it's not burning up their data. It uploaded, in my case, through Wi-Fi so it's not burning up my data, which is makes me very happy. And it will be the same quality in which it was recorded. It will not be some hacked down version. Now the person receiving this is actually an Apple person. I know, boo. Um, but I already sent this to him. And as you can see, I sent him the video and he said, yep, uh, it downloads as an MP4 and he can watch it. And uh, certainly this works on any uh, other devices. But let me just show you that link uh, and a way you could get it. If you say you wanted to send this to somebody else, you can click and hold uh, a link that you sent and select copy text. 
And now I can go paste that link anywhere. Now I, I'm going to paste it into the same uh, person here, but that's kind of silly. He already has a copy of it. But you can see there's the address right there, right? That's the address that Samsung has just given me for free to upload this uh, file to. So at this point, if I click send, he'd get a copy of that video again. Well, he'd get a link to that video again. All right, if you found this video useful, please click like uh, and or subscribe. Really helps with Google algorithm, and so we'd super appreciate it. You can leave your comments below, we'll get back to you, or you can always get a hold of us at www.urtech.ca. Thanks, bye-bye.